this is Mary with All Things Automotive, bringing you here today a 2022 Chevrolet Silverado 2500 Custom. This vehicle features a 6.6 liter V8 gasoline engine with four wheel drive. There have been no accidents or damages reported to Carfax and this vehicle is a Carfax certified one owner. As we get closer to the front of this vehicle, you'll be able to see that it is a Summit white clear coat with chroma black accents as you'll be able to see down there around the tow hooks and on that front grill. I also want to mention you do have skid plates underneath here if you're ever going in some rocky terrain. We'll come along here to the side and take a look over here at this pickup's tires and wheels. This pickup has 20 inch silver aluminum alloy wheels with gray insets. And as for the tire chips, you have got a good amount of life left in them, but I'll get you those exact measurements in just a second. As this vehicle, along with all the other vehicles here at All Things Automotive, has undergone a new multi-point inspection, as well as received a fresh oil change, a new cabin air filter, and a new engine air filter. So you don't need to worry about replacing any of those anytime soon. Here on the outside of your mirror caps, you do have your turn signal indicators integrated into those. And we'll now just take a look here to the inside of this pickup. Here on the inside of this vehicle, you do have a lovely jet black cloth upholstery for a smooth and comfortable ride. And like I had mentioned earlier, you do have those chroma black accents making their way up the dashboard. While we're looking over here, I'll just open up the glove box and bring up the results of that multi-point inspection that I was talking about. As you'll be able to see on here, you've got green checks the entire way around. And as for your tire treads, you have 10 30 seconds in both your front tires and 11 30 seconds in both your rear tires. And as for your brake pads, you have 16 30 seconds in the front and 15 30 seconds in the rear. So you have a long, long ways to go before you need to replace any of those wearables. You also have the original owner's manual with the purchase of this vehicle. So if you have any questions after you buy, you'll be able to look them up in there. We'll now continue around to take a look at the rear occupant seating. And as you'll be able to see there, you do have a nice black step to help these rear passengers get up and into the cab. As you'll be able to see, this vehicle does seat a total of six people as that middle seat does fold up in front and you have the three people sitting here as well. And down on the floor, you do have all weather floor mats to help keep your floors nice and clean. Over here on the doors, all of the doors do have a storage space there in the bottom as well as powered windows. I'll just close that door and we'll continue to make our way back to the rear of this vehicle. And while we're making our way back, I do want to point out that behind all the wheels, you do have mud guards to help prevent not only mud and snow from flinging up on your pickup, but things that might take away the paint, like stone chips or gravel. As you may have already noticed back here, you do have a pre-installed tow bar for a trailer hitch hookup, as well as a spare tire right behind it. And you also have those classic Chevy corner steps to help you get up and into the bed. You also have a backup camera to help you whenever you're parking or going in reverse. And this pickup in particular does come with tailgate assist, so it goes right down for you without slamming. This three quarter ton pickup does have a bed that's over six and a half feet, so you have a lot of space back here to haul some really nice loads. And you also have a spray and bed liner to help protect the bed from any scratches or nicks those loads might give it. I'll just put the tailgate back up and we'll continue around here now to the driver's side. I would like to mention that with the purchase of this vehicle, you do get two keys for your convenience and to help prevent you from ever getting locked out of your vehicle. And I'd also like to mention that both of these keys do come with remote start as well. This pickup does have powered mirrors, powered windows, and powered door locks. And as for your seating adjustments, you do have four-way manual seating adjustments so you can move the seats forwards, backwards, and then tilting the seat forward and back. You also have a tilting steering wheel, meaning you could push it up and down to fit you as you like. And to the left of that steering wheel, you've got your parking brake, headlight controls, bed light, dashboard backlight controls, and then your four wheel drive shift and tow haul mode switch. I'll now just get in this pickup and turn it on for you. This pickup does use its key to start as opposed to a push to start. And now that the engine's running and the dashboard's lit up, you'll be able to see this vehicle has about 7,343 miles on it. And to the left of the steering wheel over here, you do have your cruise controls right there. We'll now take a look here to the center of the vehicle. Up top, you do have a small storage space. And here in the center, you do have a lovely touchscreen LCD display. And I'll just put it in reverse to show you that backup camera in action. Right underneath that display, you do have buttons for it, as well as your volume knob right here. A bit farther down, you've got your climate control settings there. 
Further down still, you do have your traction control toggle, which helps to prevent skidding and sliding. And again, that power tailgate. This pickup does come with an integrated trailer braking controller as well, a USB charging port, and then a power outlet there. Back here, you've got two cup holders, small storage space, and then your main storage compartment back here. And like I had mentioned earlier, this seat does fold up to become that additional sixth seat. We'll now move on to the last section of this video. Here in the last section of this video, we do want to address that this vehicle is pre-owned, so we'll be looking around for any blemishes, nicks, or stains. We know a lot of our customers come from very far away, so we want to be as straightforward as we can be with the purchasing process. We want you to know what you're getting with the purchase of this vehicle, imperfections, and all. So as I look around the inside of this pickup, I do notice you have small wear in a few spots like a small stain there and one here on this rear driver's side door but other than those nothing is really standing out to me about the inside of this pickup so we'll move along to take a look at the outside We'll just be looking up and down again for any of those imperfections starting by coming along here to the front here along the front i do see several small small nicks most likely from stone chipping or gravel stone chipping is extremely common almost every vehicle has some form of it the only way you can really prevent it is just by not driving your vehicle This vehicle also has low miles on it, so it has very few compared to many other pickups that I see. You have some coming up, maybe spun up by the wheels down there, and a little bit of scratching on that passenger side door handle. Small one right there. Continue around here now to the rear. You have a little bit of staining right there near the top of the tailgate. And speaking of, also on pickups where I do tend to see several imperfections is on the top of tailgates as people don't take care of putting items in and taking items out. And that is the case for this pickup. You do have some nicking and scratching on the top of it, as well as some staining and scratching in the bed. That spray in bed liner is doing a good job of absorbing a lot of that that the loads are giving it. Got a stain there. A scratch there. We'll come back along here to the driver's side. An imperfection there on that handle. around that driver handle as well. And we are back to where we started. That generally concludes this video vehicle tour. This vehicle has a lot of great features to offer. If you're interested in a three quarter ton crew pickup with the ability to seat six, a lot of space in that bed with a spray in bed liner, backup camera, tailgate assist, a pre-installed tow bar, spare tire, corner steps, mud guards, skid plates, all weather floor mats, smartphone integration, an integrated trailer brake controller, tow hooks, two keys with remote start, and four wheel drive, this is a good option for you. If you're interested in this vehicle, come and check it out at All Things Automotive. Located at 21518, Great Cove Road, McConnellsburg, PA. Or you can give us a call at 717-485-4224. You can also check out this three-quarter ton pickup and other listings on our website at www.allthingsautomotive.com. Thank you for watching this video and have a great day.